Yeah. JoJo, Larry Farrington was the suit. Uh, what was the cat in the hat? What okay. was they sophomore year's musical? Lame 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 Lame. Lame. I don't remember if that was a musical. Lame Lame. 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 Hey, uh, when's the Euro test? Is it tomorrow That's or next week? Ah! Okay, thank you. Goodbye. What, is it? <laughs> what? Where did that go? I don't know if you should have bigger guns. You know, precious, when you smile. What is this? I don't know. Oh, that's good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No, you're mine. <laughs> good morning, Ephida. My name is Bon. James Bon. And today is Thursday, April 26th. Please rise for a moment of silence and the pledge to the flag. I like it. <laughs> Gotta make some use of the suits. I haven't even started that Euro chapter, and the test is tomorrow. I have to read the whole chapter. And do about That's what I do for all the kind of World War II, so it won't be like I could probably <clears throat> not read any of it and take the test and still get a B on it. But just Hitler. You know. I don't want to. I don't know anything about like the individual battles. Hey, do you like going to school events? Do you like taking photos? Well, then you should consider joining the Cloister Red Yearbook. Starting May 1st, the club will resume their Tuesday meetings in Mr. Jeremy Bischoff's oh! room, which is 318, to work on the spring edition. Any students who wish to participate in the next year's book should attend. They will learn all about taking pictures, captioning, and the whole yearbook process. See you there. Attention! All ninth and 10th grade students planning to attend college or another post-secondary school, we will be hosting a spring financial aid night in partnership with the Pennsylvania Higher Education Assistance Agency on Thursday, May 10th from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. in the EHS Auditorium. Come to learn more about career exploration, post-secondary planning, and student borrowing. Don't forget to bring your laptop and your parents. This is a great opportunity to start planning for your future today. Attention, freshmen! That's attention, freshmen. Fresh freshmen! The no sub sale is being extended through this Friday. That's the tomorrow, which is the 27th of April. Remember, after this date, if you have not returned anything to room 214, your name will be added to the obligation list. Return your form, money, or two dollars to avoid being placed on the obligation list because that follows you throughout all four years of high school. Then you can't graduate, like he said. Now, over to uh, Eddie Boy C with the news. I have some videos to tell you. It's funny. I do it pancakes. <laughs> Kim Jong Un, dictator of North Korea, is currently set to enter into South Korean territory for talks with President Moon Jae-in to discuss North Korea's recent intimations that it would be willing to scrap its nuclear weapons program. It will be the first time a North Korean leader has entered South Korean territory since 1953, a year that marks the end of the Korean War. The meeting is set to occur at 9.30 local time on Friday. Also, did you know that North Korea has its own time zone? It's half an hour behind South Korea, and that's the level of pettiness I aspire to. John Wilkes Booth, the man who assassinated Abraham Lincoln, is killed on this day in history just 12 days after he shot the president. Booth was not only one of the most famous actors in the country, he was also a Maryland native and a strong supporter of the Confederacy. When he assassinated Lincoln, he thought he would be seen by the South as a hero, but it soon became apparent that without Lincoln, the South was going to have a difficult time adjusting to the Union during Reconstruction. Booth was discovered hiding in a barn, and Union soldiers killed him when he refused to cooperate. Now back to the main desk with lunch. Check out the new Simple Strawberry Smoothie, Brownie Parfaits, mm, and sounds so good. Cold Brewed Coffee, I want available that. in this section. Wow. Amazing. It's pretty. It's 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 fantastic. Today for lunch we have a hot dog on the roll, uh, southern turkey BBQ on a whole grain roll, a four meat or four cheese pizza, a uh, turkey club toast. Whoa. Uh, fruit and yogurt parfait with a muffin, sauerkraut, baked beans, coleslaw, tossed salad, fresh fruit, or cucumbers and dip, applesauce, fresh fruit, or that uh, good old slushy. Also a crispy chicken salad that I skipped. <laughs> Anyways, now over to sports. I guess they're in the Are you gonna right do now. the thing? Yeah, I don't think so. Hello! Hey, can you guys be quiet? Gotta work. Getting down. We get graded for this. 
It's part of our assessment. So yeah, volleyball has a game in it anyhow. Yeah. That 11 is, yeah, that's great. Back to the main desk. That's pretty good. Pick on a senior day is coming up. It will be held on May 11th. Here is your chance to bid on one of the seniors and dress them in the most creative way possible. Please, dress me better than this. Bidding will be held in ca the cafeteria during your lunch from April 24th through May 8th. Seniors sh who choose to participate should sign up during lunch. If you have any questions, stop down to see Mr. Marzak in room 137. We hope to see everyone wearing blue today to represent prostate and colon cancer. Uh, tomorrow, wear uh, pink and orange to represent breast cancer and leukemia. The uh, Real Day for Life was very successful yesterday. Thank you for making it a G-R-E-A-T day. If you have not donated yet, there's still time. Still time. Well, after that, have a snazzy day. That's, that's it. I, I don't know why I feel so classy. I feel like we should just be like, oh, waiters, uh, we have a service offering. Edwin, I can take you to him, table. myself. Uh, if, you, if you guys will be our guest, we'll uh, get out of here. More than happy to be able to get out. Guest, be our guest. Put our service. You were guest star. We should make a. Uh... <laughs>